so I'm going to be doing a haul. What I bought at Ulta and Walgreens. Walgreens is cool, right? I'm always there. Um, there's Oliver just hanging out on the couch. So yeah, I'm just going to show you the stuff I bought and explain it, and maybe you'll buy it too. Who knows? Okay, so I'm going to start with Walgreens because that's where I went first. And, alright, so I bought, actually, <laughs> he's biting on my camera. Oliver! Oliver! No! That's not something you chew on. No, no. <laughs> what a silly. Anyways, so I bought this lipstick, and it's the one I'm wearing right now. Um, I'll tell you the details, but that is the color. Um, I guess I'll put it on my hand so you'll see a better depiction of it. Yeah, I think it's a really subtle pink, not too bright and not too dark, so it's kind of nice not red. The, um, it's Bit of Berry 175 by Maybelline. Maybelline is one of my favorite drugstore brands. I just like their products a lot for some reason. So yeah, then I bought three nail polishes. I have this purple color from L'Oreal and it was they had a deal where you buy one get the other one free so I was like hey why don't I go for it. And the nail color is Oh, paparazzi pleaser. Paparazzi pleaser. One coat of it. So you guys can see what it looks like. So yeah, it's just this purplish color. Sorry about the other purple. Yeah, that's the color. It's like a lavender. I think that's a pretty nail color to have. In the spirit of Halloween, I got this orange color. Let's hold it into the light. Um, and they have a lot of colors right now, and the color is Courtney Orange. Why is Courtney Orange? I was planning on making pumpkin nails, and I'm probably going to make a tutorial on that, so look out for that. You're probably going to need two coats of orange, but yeah, that is the orange color. Hopefully you can see it. Then I have one more color, and it's this kind of mermaidy green blue color. And the name of it is the Muses, the Muses Attitude. And yeah, I think it's a really pretty color. This one's really, really dark. Oh no! Yeah, it's that color. Now my nail is multicolored for school tomorrow. Yay! So if you donate to breast cancer at Ulta, you get this free bag. Woohoo! I bought these Katy Perry eyelashes. They are cool kitty, and they're actually very cool. Then I got this light night cream by Neutrogena, and just because I like to moisturize my face a lot, so I got that, and I have a moisturizer with an SPF 35 for the day, and now I have one for night, so I no longer use the same one for night and day. Thought that was a pretty good idea. I also got... This, it is, um, it's about, it's a oil-free acne wash, pink grapefruit, grapefruit scrub. So yeah, it's a scrub. And I used it this morning, and it smelled so good, and it felt really good. I saw this on another YouTuber's vlog. I really like her videos so much. Her name is Fleur, and her YouTube channel is Fleur De Force, and she is from the UK. So it makes her ten times cooler. Um, and she was talking about this brand, which she says you can only get here. And so it's hard finding it over there. So yay, I live in the U.S., but I don't want to live here. I want to live in the U.K. Yeah, it's called It's a Ten. So I'm going to try that because I'm going to take a shower and then just spray it in my hair. And apparently it does ten different things. It repairs dry, damaged hair, adds shine, detangles, controls frizz, seals and protects hair color, Prevents split ends, stops hair breakage, creates silkiness, enhances natural body, flat iron spray, and thermal protection. So it's a 10! Yeah, I'm really excited to use that because my hair it needs some product. And I also bought another pair of fake eyelashes. 
and Eiler. I actually like that brand so much. It's a pretty good brand. Um, yeah, so this one actually had a picture of the British flag and said, well, it has, it's only red, but it says UK number one. So I was like, definitely have to get these. So yeah. I actually was eyeing them and then I noticed that UK number one, so it just added to my Anglophile-ness. I will try these on and maybe I'll... Apart from beauty products, I bought two candles, Oliver, stop biting that. Um, two candles and they smell amazing. I just have to unpackage them. I haven't used them yet. I'm probably going to use them right now. I usually fill the, my room with the scent and Oliver has to deal with it. So this one is a Yankee candle and it is home sweet home. Yeah. Um, it smells very like autumn-y and Oh, no, just pumpkin. Like it reminds me of like warmth and just like the holiday season makes me happy. My last thing that I bought from Ulta is this Yankee candle as well. And I bought it in a big one because this one smells amazing. And it's called Midsummer's Night. It has a little picture of a moon. It smells so good. I'm gonna be so sad when when it finishes, which is going to be a long time from now, obviously. That is my haul. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope it wasn't too boring and bland. I hope Oliver gave some character to it. Um, thank you for watching and subscribe, please, if you enjoy my videos or if you want more, please, um, or like the video. I, you could do either or comment on it. I really appreciate that kind of thing because I really like YouTube. So thanks, um, hope you enjoyed my Vlogtober 11. I know I've been skipping days and I'm really bad at keeping up with it, but it's just that I have so much homework. I'm excited for tomorrow because it's Friday. Woohoo! Dance. Right, Oliver? You're happy about it? You're happy about it? Oh, I scared him. <laughs> well, anyways, thanks for watching. What up? What up? What up? Woohoo! Thug life, right? Aww. Hello, so, um, you know how I have a chinchilla and he loves his little dust baths? So I'm going to show you how much he enjoys them. Hold on, I need to set out a newspaper. Because he makes the most gigantic mess. Whenever, no, no, don't look at it. Don't look at it. It's not there. He already sees his dust bath and he's getting excited. No. I'm just gonna put that over there. He is way too excited about this. Alright. Go. You look like an old man, Oliver, but you're a little baby. Alright, so that's him in his dust bath. Aren't you happy?